Welcome. All right. I'm afraid we're gonna go ahead and say farewell to Rise for just a moment. We'll come back to Rise in just a bit tonight. We're gonna be spending just a bit of the night in another game here. We jump on over here to a different scene. Where is my camera? Here I am. Hello. Update that. One moment. Always takes me just a second to get this set up. Hello, Shadow Childs. Yeah, we started a little late. I'm a little sleepy tonight. All right, let's get that so I can hear it. Oh, there's no sound. It would help if we had sound. Here we go. <laughs> okay. Hopefully the sound should be uh, good for you guys. So again, this is going to be a birthday challenge from Fish Kebab for us to do a Freemanite Lavasioth using Hammer. I don't like Freemanite Lavasioth. I do like Freemanite Hammer, though. And I like Fish Kebab. So we're going to be doing a birthday challenge for them. Then we'll go back to Rise in just a bit. Sorry for the bait and switch. I didn't really mean, I really, didn't really mean to do that, but I, I kind of forgot we were doing this until just a moment. <laughs> just a moment ago. Just take a gradual fog and you'll be okay. You also forgot about this? Okay, then we're on the same page. Right above you there, Arcane. Fish kebab. It's their it's their birthday. Wish them happy birthday. Or it was their birthday a day or two ago. Cozy intro cutscene, you gotta do it. It's not my birthday, Joe's cool skinny, it's fish kebabs. I guess you guys are probably saying that to fish kebab and not me. Man, I'm just, <laughs> I'm out of it tonight. I'm like, oh yeah, say happy birthday to fish kebab. And then I sit here like, it's not my birthday. Hey Uchi, hello Haruush. Gen 2 Wrath. They look so goofy, don't they? What a good cutscene. What will you be hunting? I'm going to be hunting a Freemanite Lavasioth, which is exclusive to G rank, using a hammer. How's the volume on things tonight for you guys? I, I change things around when I do a co-op stream like last night, so sometimes there's a, sometimes there's tweaks to be done as we start our stream. <sighs> hey, Babs. All right. Free me night it is. Great balance, IMO. Okay, good. Thank you. What game introduced the tower map? That would be Monster Hunter Dose, as far as I know. <sighs> Dude, it's so cozy here. Move this microphone a little bit. Let's see, Lavasioth. What's the backstory for your character name, Wrist? Um, my real life name is Michael. 
and I wanted to choose a name that was similar to that, but a little bit stylized and could be used for male or females, so Michelle it was. Guild card? Let's see it. I haven't looked at my guild card in this game in a while. Looking pretty okay. Not everything's over 100. No treasure quests yet. That's a lot of longsword. I love Gen 2 longsword so much. Hey, Siphonia. Okay. The way you said Michael reminded you of the German Rat song. Oh god. I'm sorry, Game God. Hi, how you doing? <laughs> How's Elements in this game? Uh, it's okay. I don't believe there's a village Lavasioth. I think the first Lavasioth you fight is here in G Rank Hub. It's one of the first one of the first monsters, right? Or am I misremembering that? Maybe there is a high rank Lavasioth. I cannot do a speed run to you, Canlos. I believe you've got Death Stark on the brain, you arcane. How is Sword and Shield in this game? It's okay. It's not as crazy buffed as um as Freedom 1. But it's still an okay weapon. Is there a bossy off in, in Village? Probably not. I think he's a G-Rank exclusive. There's only G-Rank Lavasi off. That's what I thought. I couldn't remember though. We're gonna switch to Rise in a while, Game God. It is a birthday hunt. Hi. Feels birthday, man. I was under the impression it was one of the early G-Rank hunts. But I don't see it here in G1, so it must be G2. Yep. Are you playing this on PSP? I'm playing it on a PlayStation Vita, which does have a PlayStation P or a PlayStation P, a PSP's <laughs> CPU on the inside somewhere in there. Hunt two of Osios, please no. Life powder. Weird. Uh-oh, are we running low on, on honey? We sure are. That's not good. I like the way they made poke. Or the, you like the way they made poke look in GU? Yeah, it's nice. Arcane, I am sorry, but birthday hunts can only happen on your birthday or like close to your birthday. If everyone could like choose when they wanted to redeem theirs, it would be a little bit too frequently, I think. <laughs> if you wait around till next April, I will do one for you though. Okay, potions and mega potions, antidotes. Probably won't eat any of those, but you never know. We need cool drinks, that's for sure. Whoop. Yeah, I think we'll be good with that. This is my first hunt in Freeman Night in a long time. <sighs> Gecko, it's good to see you here. Same with Parsec and Uchi. It's nice to have y'all here.
You don't have to subscribe for a birthday hunt. I didn't eat. Classic. Here, have some beans for that. You don't need buffs? Ugh. I'm gonna need all the help I can get. I'm not good at this hunt. Like, I don't know. I'm sure, I hope we'll be okay. I remember having an awful time at this hunt with Hunting Horn. Can you make a hunt a channel points reward? Nope. Sorry, maybe a beans thing eventually. I'm pretty choosy about what stuff we have as a redeem. Ice tea, welcome. Welcome Ice tea and Raiders. Thank you. Thank you so much, Ice tea. Hi, Commander Henkel. Hi, FPS. Okay. We are doing a hunt in Freeman Night tonight for our friend Fish Kebab's birthday. And then we're going to be going back to Monster Hunter Rise. I think, I can't remember what I did with that double of Asioth quest. But I think I, when I was doing this game, I was doing a challenge where I was trying to clear every monster in G rank with every weapon. And so we did Lavasioth with every weapon in G rank and I believe Hunting Horn was a really tough time. We'll see how Hammer does. Not yet, Ensign Boot. Sorry, I'm nowhere near done with Rise yet. I'm enjoying myself in Rise. I'm looking forward to going back to these older games, but Rise is a pretty good time. Pretty good, too. Very good Hammer. Dude, Juggernaut's so good. All right, where's this fish? Not here. I mean, you guys, wait, we should be hyped. This is a Frontier monster. He's brand new in this game, dude. He's from Monster Hunter Frontier. How hype is that? Hmm, interesting trade. That's right, there's no multiple charge levels. There's just charge. What's your point? We should be excited and happy to fight Lavasioth because he's from Frontier, right? He's not here either. Where'd he go? He must have left just as we came in. Ice T, how was your stream tonight? What were you guys up to? It already left again. Got him. Make your progress through Rain World, a scary area. Was Uchi talking about Tropical Freeze? Is that what you were playing? Feel free and let me know if the volume's good on your end or if it's too loud. I can turn it down if need be. That's what the shoutout said? I gotcha. Nice fish AI. He already forgot I was there. What is he doing? He forgot me. He's really, really compelling in this game. Okay, here we go. Alright. The wiggle. 
Should we have checked his hit zones first? Oh, there it is, everybody. Here we go. Oh, I spun out. Samurai, welcome. Hope you're well tonight. Hope you're enjoying the Lavasioth on display here. Doing his Lavasioth thing. how quick that was. Don't forget to add up dodge, if only. Why is the head of 35? Because screw you. Enrage, yeah. Oh, I forgot he had the I forgot he had the tail, the tail flick. That wiggle, it'll kill you. That wiggle is terrifying. And he can turn around when he's enraged. He didn't that time, but he can. This fuzzy off is looking awfully cooked. Yeah, he's a bit overdone, man. Hey, Skiffy. Okay, he hasn't done the whole turnaround wiggle yet. It's it's just a menace in this game. It all comes rushing back, man. Um, it depends, Arcane. There's no real hard rule on it. I try my absolute best to finish a quest. If it seems doable, I'll give it a couple attempts. If it's kind of like crazy out there sort of a challenge, I won't always do it over and over. Are you playing on a PSP for this? Scoops, I am playing on a PlayStation Vita, which has a PSP MIPS CPU on the inside, so it does do good backwards compatibility. Hey, recital mode. we doing? What's it going to be? Huge 
guess he had sick eye frame. He eye framed it while he was stunned. It's <laughs> crazy. Oh, oh there it is. Sick eye there frame. it is. The turnaround it wiggle. Stunned. It's crazy. Thankfully, he decided to run away after it. I'm gonna eat some fish. Black Fox would be proud. Yep, Skiffy, that is the case. This is not as bad as I remember it being. It's still Lavasi out there for me night, but it's not as bad as I thought it was going to be. He says right before getting wrecked by the by the double wiggle. Oh, double wiggle with Aptanoth. <laughs> and a Vespoid. And one infinitely respawning Vespoid because screw you. Kill the apps not first, we probably should. They do not infinitely respawn, which is nice. Okay. Chief, get ready to Superman die if we're good, we don't need to. Okay. Thank you for the animation cancel, Aptonoth. Aptonoth. Alright, Aptonoth is dead. Aw, oh, the golf swing missed. That feels bad, man. And the best boy helped us with the sheath cancel. How nice. Oh, did I say Aptonoth? They are Apseros. Whoops. Hello, Isaac. Welcome. Hey, Katniss. How's it going? It's going okay. We're doing a birthday request. Fish Kebab wanted to see a free Unite Lavasioth with Hammer, and so here we are. Making unsafe super pounds on the feet. It's always going to be playing this game. Okay, now the really th the thing we really have to do is we have to wait. He's going to do a couple jumps usually. There's a jump. They don't hit you. Another jump. They don't hit you. Here he comes. Or no, not yet. A third jump. They don't hit you. All right, come on. Nope. Okay, further back. Back by the first rock. Do Sonic Bombs work on him? Nope. At least I don't think they do. It's all good, Cat. I too am slacking on RTA. <laughs> and then I haven't done it in months. <laughs> Welcome, I'm Biggie. Hey, he hit the, he hit the vest for me. <laughs> he 
You gotta look out for the best for the uh, Lavasia projectiles. Right, you can stay close for these ones. Forgot about that. It is JJ, man. He doesn't like our Juggernaut hammer. Too bad, because our Juggernaut hammer likes him. Is this thing G-rank only? Mm-hmm, yep. And at one point in time, we did this fight with all 11 weapons. <laughs> rank appropriate weapons, no less. It took a long time. G-Rank HP, HP pools with rank appropriate gear in this game are really stiff. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Either we were just outside the range of the slam or we iframe the slam. The slam does a ton of damage. It's one of his biggest moves. Which makes it really scary to go for his nice belly and feet hit zone. That's his version of flinching right there. That weird animation. He's enraged now, so he can do the double wiggle. He didn't do it, though. Every day you fear Freeman Knight more and more, just take it gradually. Just take it gradually. He was going to do the jump, too. leaving he is supplies delivered how nice okay I'm gonna go ahead and sharpen I don't want to drop out of purple it was the 11 weapon clear masochism that led so many of us here it's true that was the initial hook of this stream was Dude learns his first G rank with all 11 weapons where he does just every monster 11 times. It's still fun. I just don't know if it makes for good watching. It might. I, I don't know if I'll ever do that again. Like, I, I like doing that for certain monsters, but not every monster in the game back to back to back. Once you've seen, like, three weeks of Plesioth, it's kind of hard to be like, yeah, that's a great system. <laughs> Hey, nice. Oh, not nice. There we go. Maybe so nice. Did you do your candles with all weapons? No, Gak. I had a hard time. I mean, like, I, I cleared you candles probably three or four times at the end of the game, but I'm not very good at you candles in this game. He's really tough. I think I would need to make some, some better gear for him. Uh oh. How much did that do? Only half. I'm using health health rec items improve parsec. That's one of my favorite skills in this game. Here it comes, the wiggle. We did learn how to walk over his dig move. It wasn't that, Gecko. It was just avoid. It's the challenge I always have with you, Canlos and the Cantor. The fights are just really long. Their HP pools are pretty large, and so you have to really be good at making decent decisions the whole fight long in order to not run out of potions, not take enough innocent dental damage. Uh oh. 
So rage mode, that does significantly more. Holy crap, that's so much damage. I never got very good at that gecko, even with Sword and Shield, which was a, which was a, a matchup I considered to be pretty decent. I never really got the hang of it. I forgot the range on that move too. Whew. Hey, Sparkle Wolfie, welcome, welcome, good folks. Yeah, I just had a hard time lasting that long and making good decisions, Gecko. Old hit and pull towards a monster hitbox. Yup. Are we going to get smacked by the... Yep, the wiggle. Here it comes. Will it be the double? It will not be. For some reason, I thought he was going to fire that more off to my left there. Nope. Hey. All right. Nice. What? Oh, man. It bounced all the way back and hit me. so hard. I should have dodged in. It does feel good to me to play this game still, even if we are doing this matchup. Always down for some freebie night. Ugh. Barely missed that little swipe there. When's online for you tonight? I don't know. Did you ever do multiplayer for you tonight? Nope. feels so good in this game. Miss Monster is actually tripping. They actually trip because it doesn't happen very frequently. Hammer always feels good. It does always feel good. I think it feels especially good back in second gen here. The chunkiest hammer. Was that 20 minutes in one area? No, this is the third or fourth time we've switched areas. You could play multi, but you'll use emulation in the Hunstraverse app. Yep, I know. That's part of why I haven't done it. I just, I didn't, I haven't felt like setting up the emulator. Okay. 
<laughs> oh, we have to kill these Aptonoth first. I don't remember these Aptonoth being here. I mean, like, obviously, earlier in this fight, I remember them being here, but... I guess it's just the one this time, huh? I said Aptonoth again. I meant Epsaros. Gosh darn it. You can do Ad Hoc Party on PS3. I do have a PS3 that has Ad Hoc Party on it. Does it still work these days, Recital Mode? That's crazy if it does. If there's a way I can play online from my Vita, I might consider it more. He really just forgets you exist. That's so nuts. Dude, he's a fish. His brain's small. I almost got smacked there. Hey, Quill. Fish Kebab wanted to see a Lavasioth with Hammer, so here we are. You told me how to the other day, did you? I was still under the impression you couldn't from the Vita. Oh, I missed and I got hit by the tail. I think I ended up taking Tremorez on this fight back when we were doing with all 11. Come on, get it. Got it. Oh. <laughs> I was betting on that little flinch there. Uh oh. Don't ricochet at me, thank you. Is so intense. Oh man, my fish was wasted. You almost got away with it. I really did. No, the ricochet. It's, I think, I mean, it always goes out in four directions. I think the directions are almost random each time. So getting hit with it as many times as we have is just unlucky. This is not going well right now. This is how Free Night goes. You can be playing super cleanly for just a while, and then one, one sequence of events just goes downhill. Oh, you stupid fish. You still have two cards left to go. That's true. That would have gone really poorly because the Vespoid there ate the fireball. Alright, come on, turn around, please. Hmm, he went with the bite, of course. <laughs> I was really gonna try and roll through that. I don't think it would have gone well, but I was really gonna try. <laughs> it saved me. It did. Now it's gone for five seconds. It'll come back. Don't worry. You'll see. Yeah, he's back. See? All right. There we go. We could go by the camp and get more supplies, but I think we're going to just chill with the stuff we've got for now. 
I have two traps. I don't know if... Do pitfall traps work out here? I guess they work. We could try and trap him. It's been 25 minutes, but I might wait. Navi, but it's a Vespoid. What would the Vespoid say in safe? Hey, listen. Hey, Hera. Broke his face. Oh, I shouldn't have done this. I shouldn't have done that. I knew better. At least it sheathed my weapon for me, thanks. You can see we're not dealing KO damage to his head there. You have to only hit the head in Freeman Knight if you want to deal KO. It can't hit any other body part. Use your fire bugs. I'm trying, Ken. They don't come out, man. Something's glitched. Hey, all right, we finally got a KO. Dude, that's that that down so high value. Wow. It's ready for capture. His lava armor is turned off. It's a little Freeman Knight trick I learned on YouTube is that while you're spinning with hammer, if you mash out for the early attack, you can change directions mid-spin. It feels super cool. So spin, spin, change direction. It's useful in a couple scenarios, especially if you already have a charge held. He's raged, but you can't tell. We could cap him, but I mean, we got the carts. Let's go for it. But you knew that already? I, I knew that the last the last time we played Freeman Knight. Like, the last season of Freeman Knight, I knew that. But when I first started playing Freeman Knight, I did not know that. Yep, his lava armor doesn't flow when he's weak. Yep, see how it's turned off? It doesn't show on his body anymore. Is he going to go back in the lava? Nope. It's a shiny over here. Wouldn't mind getting it. Oh, of course. Uh-uh. 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 Nope. <laughs> Happy birthday, fish kebab. Spent the last few hours packing. Nice. I did a little bit of packing myself today, Ken. Hey, we got a fire cell stone. There's no other way to get those, so it's really good we got that off of him. Oh, the shiny's gone. Thick Lavasia scale. Thick Lavasia scale. Under the encrusted lava lies a golden treasure. Heavy Lavasia soul. Heavy scale that covers its body. Cooled lava adds to the armor. A magma-like ore, only to be handled by trained hands, aka eagle's eye. What's up, Fuji? That's some underrated <laughs> humor. I'm just reading what was on the screen, man. It's a whole of us, let's go. Can you show some of the best abbreviated item names? 
I can show you one in particular. We have the monster bone. Oh my god, that was a good one. Hang on. We'll find that one in the box. This game's fun. Thank you guys for watching some of this game tonight. Oh, it's so cozy. Okay. <laughs> That's my favorite one. Leather Silver Rathlos Tail. It's so good. <laughs> There's one vowel. <laughs> There's one. There's one vowel. <laughs> <laughs> it's so good. Mm. Kazu hide space dash space tan. Leather stands for leather? I think so. You have heavy your kernel of skull. Your kernel of under skull. You can just do the claw. <laughs> oh, I love this game. Hey, Nefudis. We just killed a Lavasioth with hammer. It was a good time. Yeah, I, I had to stop and think about that. Was it a good time? Yeah, it was a good time, actually. It was for Fish Kebab's birthday. We're missing... Oh, I, I went on that quest. I didn't even have max potions with me. It's a good thing we didn't cart. <laughs> was there any doubt? Second gen Lavasioth has not always been a fond memory in my mind. Am I out of whetstones? Who the hell runs out of whetstones? How's inventory space in the in the chest? It's pretty good. Oh, I'll show you in just a second. Recital mode. Sorry, I missed I missed you asking for that. This is my set. It's made up of Sanitar Z, UU, Kezu, Tasset, X, and Sanitar Z. And it gives... There's a, there's some there's some decos involved, obviously, but it gives health rec items improved, reckless abandon plus one, sharpness plus one, and razor sharp. I really liked... Um, as we started doing all kinds of quests for the end of this game, I really liked both how the Kezu armor looks and just... Um, I really liked health rec items improved. Yeah, this game has a purple sharpness meta, for those of you who haven't played it before. Purple is a huge boost to damage in this game, to the point where, and like, when you, when you can only fit like two or three armor skills in a late game set, like this is, four skills is a lot. I mean, you can get some sets that have a lot on them, but for most sets, four skills is a lot of skills in this game. Is it 1.5? It is 1.5, yeah. We're gonna gather here at the farm. We might even do a freaking honey run, and then we'll head back to Monster Hunter Rise. We'll be coming back to these old games soon enough. Not second gen here, but we're gonna be doing...
We're gonna be doing Monster Hunter Freedom 1 once we're done with Rise. So you're saying Freedom Night is pretty easy? Hell no. <laughs> Quill, thank you. Thank you. Thank you for the gift sub. Cheers. That's very kind of you. And enjoy the gift sub, Gecko. Who wants coffee? I just made a fresh pot of coffee. Does anybody want coffee? How's that Ethiopian blend? It's gone. It's gone now. That's weird. I don't know why that would be Ken. Welcome back, though. To those of you who are newer to the stream, if you've wondered where the coffee pants or the Ristra pants emote came from, Here they are, in all their glory. They're very toned. Glory. What are those? Dude, these are only the best of fashion. And this is the Honey Run. Thank you, Black Fox. Thanks for letting us know about that. How you doing, man? Welcome, welcome. We were fighting the Lavasioth with Hammer for Fish Kebab's birthday. We're done now. We already did it. We're going to be going back to, to Monster Hunter Rise here, but we've paid a little visit to Freeman Knight. It's always a treat. Mr. Pierce himself is here. This was a prevalent thing that we did because if you're if you if you're bad at the game, you're learning the game. The most you can <laughs> the most you can ever get from the farm in one rotation is six honey. So in order to get enough honey to keep your, your mega potion IV drip going. You gotta come out here and do a honey run. I do can, yes. Hello, Arashi. Saraika. This has been your first Freedom You. Your first time stopping by for Freedom Night, Or just in general? As you can see, honey runs are violent. Oh, yes. Super, uh... Super exciting. Training school basic quest gives honey and well done steaks. Really? In the rewards? That sounds nice. First time you've ever seen Free Mini Night? It's a good game. It's a tough game. It's old. I'll have to check that out sometime recital mode. I've always done this. How are we looking? We got nine honey. We just need one more and we can finish. Oh, did I go the wrong way? No, you got to go up and around. I remember now. Right now we're just doing some gathering. It's super good early, but people skip basic training. I've done the tra I've done most of the most of the training school stuff. I just don't remember how much honey it gives. Unless it gave close to ten, I wouldn't really m care too much. The nice thing about this is that you can pretty much always guarantee that you'll get ten since the jungle has three honey spots. All right, one more. All right, we're good. Do you polish this map hard? I like it in both versions. It's good early because you don't have the honey hive at the start. That's a good point. Thanks for Seidel. Hey, Dr. Ghost Jelly. Right, 
now the coffee's gone. All right, and that was a honey run. Did you finish the Veterans Gala quest on Rise? I am not that far in Rise yet. Nope. Hasn't unlocked in my village yet. I've done all the other village quests, but I think it's gated by hub progression. Oh yeah, someone asked what a yellow seed was a little bit ago. You can plant yellow, red, and green seeds, and you'll get other things back from the farm. I'm looking forward to it, Ken. All right. Then you can come back to the farm after your honey run, get some more honey, and then you're set for another couple quests. But that's going to be all for now. And again, happy birthday, Fish Kebab. Thanks for giving us this free minute request. What about inventory? What about FPS? Sorry. You wanted me to show the inventory box? I apologize. I'll show that before I go. Me too, Ken. Me too. get 10 pages we have three spots left so it's fine that is a problem for future wrist not me plus how could I possibly be parted from my uh, my scatter nuts can't get rid of those yeah my bone husks how could I possibly be Separated from my husk berries. No G rank crimson or white parts. Dude, I stopped at Black Fatty. He broke me. He completely broke me wide open in this game. I was like, yep. Yep, that's where I stopped for now. My guild card? We looked at it earlier, but I'll show it again. Not the most even thing in the world. There are clearly some favorites there, but everything's almost to 100. This is my second most played Monster Hunter game. The first is 4 Ultimate. You weren't joking, you do love old Longsword? Dude, second gen Longsword is so freaking good. You guys can't hear the Elgato right now, can you? Okay, good. Right now I'm hearing Rise and this at the same time. I only started liking Sword and Shield really like a ton in the last year or so. Like before that, it wasn't my favorite. Evade Lance is your long lost love? It was, yeah. Second gen longsword, honestly, might be my, my favorite weapon in the whole series. That's quite a lot of crowns. We've, we've hunted a ton of stuff. We've been lucky on the crowns, I guess. All right, that's been Free Me Night. What was different about Longsword back then? There was no spirit levels. You still had the spirit gauge you'd fill up and then you could use that gauge to deal damage. Um, but there were no levels, so you weren't always trying to get a finisher and get up to your highest level and stay there. You were mainly just focused on, okay, how do I fit these moves into a combo? That was mostly it. You couldn't fade slash in multiple directions. There was no counter. It was mostly just, here are the basic longsword moves, use those. And 
I like those moves, so I really like it. 